Hey guys, Sandy Evans here, your systems and operations strategist and ClickUp consultant. So in today's ClickUp training, we are going to be talking task and team management. So um, what I wanna show you how to do today is how to plan out your day um, and your team's day right inside of ClickUp. So let's jump in. We are currently on the home screen of ClickUp. So all you have to do if you're not there is click on your home button and this is what it looks like. So to the right, you have your calendar for the day um, and it's broken out by time. Um, so that you can time block. And I always encourage my clients and my team to time block so that you can stay focused and achieve um, optimum productivity each day without falling down in rabbit holes. Okay. So um, here you have the, your lineup and your lineup is um, tasks that are prioritized for the day. So you'll be able to see anything that you have at the top of your to-do list um, that's high priority as well as your team. So you can kind of gauge what everybody is working on for the day. Um, and then here you see the trending. Your trending is what is being most heavily worked on um, on a daily and weekly basis. So these things that you see here under trending are tasks that have been worked on or are being worked on the most within your workspace. And then, of course, you've got my work. My work is um, the section where all of your tasks that are assigned to you are going to be. So this is your to-do list, right? So what I like to do is um, start with my to-do list and find what it is that I'm gonna be working on. So my top three things for the day um, are gonna be, let's say, working on uh, my dub saddle automations. My day starts around nine, so I'm gonna start with that at nine o'clock. I'm gonna go ahead and drop it in there, right? So from nine to 10, I'm gonna be working on dub saddle automations, right? Now, let's just say that I need a little more time. Well, from now, now from nine to 11, I'm gonna be working on Dubsado automations. Then let's just say at 11, I'm gonna take a break. And then I'm gonna switch on over to um, working on some of this SEO and site optimization, right? So I'm gonna take a quick break. And then at 11.30, from 11.30 to 12.30, I'll be working on site optimization. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab some of these overdue tasks because those are at the top of the list that I have not done and I need to go ahead and grab those. So I am going to work on drafting this case study at 1 p.m. Right. And so you can just drag and drop whatever it is that you need um, to do for the day into your calendar. And as long as your calendar is synced, you'll get um, reminders. If you're synced with an Apple calendar or with a Google calendar, you'll get those same reminders because this is going to sync to your actual calendar so that appointments can't be scheduled over top of it if you don't want them to be um and things like that. And then again, if you just need to increase or decrease that time, all you have to do is drag up or drag down to increase or decrease your time, right? So now our time is planned out for the day. We know that these are the top three things that I'm going to be working on for the day. Next, I'm going to go in um, or you could do this before and check and see if there are any comments. So your comments are gonna be maybe from other team members, it may be from clients, if you're managing um, your projects for clients in here and you wanna just go through your inbox and see any comments. And as you can see, there are no comments um, in my work today, but let's just say that there were, um, see we can go ahead and create a comment here 